when ax cube plus 2x square minus 3x plus b is divided by x plus 1, the remainder is 3, and when divided by x plus 2, the remainder is 1, we need to find a and b. So we can apply remainders theorem. So let's do f minus 1 for this one. If this is fx, so that will be a minus 1 cube plus 2 minus 1 square minus 3 minus 1 plus b and that will be equal to 3 because 3 is the remainder. So that's minus a plus 2 minus uh, plus 3 plus b is equal to 3 there fx uh, is equal to ax cube minus 2x square minus 3x plus b when divided by x plus 1 the remainder is 3 when divided by x plus 2 the remainder is 1 uh, we need to find a and b so if we apply remainder theorem if we write f minus 1 there so that's a minus 1 cube minus 2 minus 1 square minus 3 minus 1 plus b that will be 3 because 3 is remainder so minus a minus 2 plus 3 plus b is equal to 3 so b minus a and then this 3 minus 2 is 1 goes on the other side becomes 2 so that is one equation and then if I write f minus 2 so that will be a minus 2 cube minus 2 minus 2 square minus 3 into minus 2 plus b and the remainder is uh, 1 so that will be equal to 1 so that's minus 8a and then 4 times 2 is negative 8 plus 6 plus b is equal to 1 so that b minus 8a will be negative 2 there goes on the other side so it becomes 3 so that's the second equation so we can uh, do 1 minus 2 equation and b b gets cancelled because this is 1 a it becomes 7 a and that one becomes negative 1 so a is negative 1 seventh that's the value of a and once we have a we can plug in the value of a in, maybe in this equation so b minus a is 2 as we have it here so we can write b is equal to a plus 2 and a is negative 1 over 7 plus 2 so that's 7 here negative 1 plus 14 so that's negative 13 over 7 that's the value of b uh, that will be positive though sorry 13 over 7 so we can write it like 1 7 and 6